A big night at one of the most famous venues in world football. We're here at the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Inter against Borussia Dortmund. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. A look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic begins between the posts. Stefan de Frey plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Manuel Akanji plays with Mats Hummels in central defence. Julian Brandt plays alongside Mahmoud Dahoud in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Oh, surely. And he thought of the attack with a masterful tackle. Ivan Perisic. An awful lot of green space to run into. And Dzeko's in there. Not Rip Perisic. Vigorous defending. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Dzeko. Well, no danger now. And the keeper taking care of the situation. Well, Hakan Chalanolu has many eye-catching qualities in his game. Stuart, what do you think we should expect to see from him today? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to... Real chance! Well, he gave it real leather, but miles off target. Dzeko. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Holland. Brandt. On to Holland. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Barella. Now Minier. What a shocking pass, really. 
Martinez. Martinez! Still a chance. It is going to be a Dortmund free kick. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Dahoud. Daniel Malen. It's with Dahoud. Moving the ball forward with purpose. But quick thinking defensively. He continues his run. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Holland. Brandt with it. Daniel Malen. Now what can they do from here? Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not the best clearance. Can they get in behind them? And on to Bellingham. Holland. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Barella. Good looking sequence. Martinez. Now Perisic. Clears it away. Martinez. Pulls it back. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. Dzeko. Well, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri. Can he do it to take the lead? It's got to be. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. And a goal! The opening statement in this semi-final. How important can that prove to be? Well, here it is again, and you have to say it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Borussia Dortmund restart the match. Will that goal have the effect of stinging them into action? Brandt. Now Holland. Bellingham. An important interception. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Will they profit from this situation? And he's clear his lines. Crisp tackling. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Rice. Brandt. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Trying to deliver it accurately. 
And using his body to good effect. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I really liked his first-half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field, and I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Brozovic. De Frey. It's with Chalhanolu. Chalhanolu. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Matteo Damian. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. Chalhanolu. Well, disappointing end to the move. Brandt. Akanji has it. Read it superbly to take back possession. Sustained pressure, and now they have the ball. Damian. Dzeko. Perisic. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Taking care of business defensively here. Damian. Martinez. On to Dzeko. Chance to finish. Martinez. There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer. Well, he puts it away really well, as you can see. But you'd expect him to score from that range. But they all count. So 2-0 now. 30 minutes to go then. Guerrero. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? But they took care of the situation defensively. Barella. Well, failure to keep the ball by the Nerazzurri. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. They need to get bodies back. Chalhanolu. And he read it really well. Fine save. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Played in by Brozovic. And a bit short with the clearance. Well, they can bring it out now. He's got the right idea with that pass. Royce. Well, possibilities inside the box. Determined defending. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. He takes aim. Real chance. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition! 
television job. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And a substitution in the offing. Well, on with the action. Inter dominant. This is starting to get out of hand, you just feel. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Rice. Rice. No, not the best challenge. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Well, the keeper should grab hold of it. Dahoud. Torgan Azar. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Well, he really read that brilliantly. And a goal kick given. And Dortmund will go to the bench. And he did well to cut it out. Chalanolu. Can he do it? And Hummels always in charge of the situation after the cross. Inter have given away possession. Hummels. Mini eight. It's with Guerrero. Wonderful tackle. Holland. And now Brandt. Chan. Chance to finish. Holland. And now Chan. It might be. And he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Jekko. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. And that's an important intervention. The final whistle then, the second leg to come, but Inter with the lead after this first match. Well, they were really good today. Their approach play, their movement off the ball, and of course their finishing were excellent, as was their work rate. A disciplined performance in the second leg, and they're into the final. Well, as wily strikers go, Edin Dzeko has always been up there with the best of them throughout his career, Stuart. Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with today.